Hi, I'm Randall Barney, WTA's Membership Director. We're at IBC speaking with industry executives about the impact and evolution of new technologies in the teleport services and technology segment. Well, yes, absolutely. We at uh, DOV have been offering RF transmission solution, solutions uh, specifically for the requirement of KA band HGS capacity systems. In uh, particular, we are addressing the need of high availability, which is crucial for KA band transmission. It's also crucial for gross market applications like carrier grade services, enterprise networks, and mobile backhaul to generate a high degree of acceptance. In uh, order to achieve this high availability, we provide fast redundancy switching in combination with high density DWGM RF over fiber solutions. In this field, we benefit from our domain knowledge of switch control. Some nanoseconds are enough to switch from one point to another. For our customers, it's utmost important that we not only deliver reliable technology, but also provide our professional expertise in system planning, installation, and of course also supervision services. Currently, we are closely following the development in emerging microsatellite technology in low Earth orbit. But uh, I expect that the majority of our business in the next years will still originate from traditional satellite system architectures. Well, I'm excited about the new business opportunities emerging with the widespread use of KA band satellite systems. Traditionally, commercial satellite communication systems were mainly used to broadcast telephone or television service. Now today, demand for higher data transmission rate is rapidly increasing and basically everything can be regarded as data. Consequently, data communication over satellite becomes increasingly important, as well as others. HTS systems will expand our business to provide satellite-based data communication systems, e.g. the application areas of internet access or mobile backhaul. From a technology point of view, this turn to data-centric signal transmission means that we will see an increasing amount of bidirectional L-band transmission systems in the future. We are pleased to be able to provide these solutions today, even for transmission distances over 100 km, by using our CWDM or DWM, RF over fiber transmission technology. I would like to add that our current L-band RF transmission solutions and products for HTS KA band and KU band systems are the result of major investment in product development. In particular, our RF over fiber transmission solution are based on our long-lasting know-how and collaboration with universities in Germany. Uh, the disruptive character of new developments in the HTS area will have an impact on how service providers will act in the market. The speed of change and the competition will force the players to roll out their offerings more rapidly and more efficiently than ever before. Service providers will have to rely on partners with technical expertise who can support them extremely quick to explore new market segments and to help to fulfill reliable availability demands. Furthermore, let me say that uh, we see professional services and support as an integral part of our high quality products and systems. With our Triple C protection service, which is standard for all our products, we provide, amongst others, 37 months of warranty, free shipment of equipment for repair, and guaranteed service level like telephone support. With the evolution of HTS systems, we expect the demand of system planning and on-site support services to increase as these systems are technologically more complex than legacy satellite systems. 
thereby involvement of DMV in an early planning phase is a key in order to identify the best suited solution for the customer. The RF solution has a large impact on the overall system architecture, so I, ex I expect relationships with our customers to be further identified in the future as well. Well, I expect the business volume of KA band systems to be steadily increasing over the next years. In particular, the amount of DWDM transmission systems will increase significantly. DWDM stands for Dense Wavelength Division Multiplexing and allows us the signal transmission of up to 40 RF signals over a single fiber and regardless of the transmission direction, so it could be bidirectional. HGS KA band systems require a distant separation of main and diverse antenna site due to the high sensitivity of KA band signal transmission to rainfall. Furthermore, cost of the lease of, uh, the lease of dark fibers for optical transmission can be in the range of several hundred dollars per mile per year. By using DWM transmission systems, our customers benefit from significant OPEX saving, savings as only a single fiber is needed. DV has already realized several of these DWM RF over fiber solutions, including optical amplifiers, optical ley lines, and other built in equipment as redundancies. And we are looking forward to plan and realize many more of these systems in the future.